Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I have to tell you that Hurricane Michael is now a Category 3 hurricane with 120 mile per hour winds. And knowing that, I would say it is a probability it will be a Category 4 at landfall. And I have to be the one to tell you it is possible for Hurricane Michael to become a Category 5 hurricane. Now, the reason I say this is because if you look at Hurricane Wilma in 2005, or Hurricane Maria, remember that one? Okay. They went from a tropical storm to a Category 5 hurricane in 54 hours. So, if Hurricane Maria, I mean, I'm sorry, if Hurricane Michael has 22 hours to develop more, and it's already a Category 3, logic would say that there is a chance I'm not saying it's definitely going to happen, but if you need to be prepared for the worst and pray for the best. But with 22 hours of development and temperatures near 86 degrees in the area, it is a possibility. So, if you have the means to evacuate near landfall, I would do so <clears throat> because these storm surge levels are set for, you know, it making a landfall at category three. <clears throat> if you get category four or five, storm surge levels are going to be much higher. And I think it's happening right around high tide. So I, you know, I keep checking the highways, and it isn't, last time I checked, it wasn't crowded. There's not a bunch of traffic. There's not a bunch of people trying to evacuate. I know there are a bunch of people at the gas lines today, which, you know, has me questioning, because I put out a warning on September 30th, saying, here comes a hurricane. So it's like 10 days. And, you know, I told everybody, buy your preps now. Even five days ago, I went out, you know, lock it in. There's no reason to not buy a full tank of gas then. I don't know why everybody waits till 24 hours till the... But I will say my prayers. And people will get mad that I'm even suggesting this. But, you know, at a time when now 335 rivers are flooding in the United States of America. And when was the last time you heard the media mention that? You know, the hurricane is going to hit here and then run all the way up here over all these flooding river levels. And then on top of that, let's go to, so you have 335 rivers flooding. You have a hurricane about to hit Florida over the flooding areas, and then you have that storm moving over the river flooding levels. Uh, it's a crazy time, and these are crazy days. So I hope everybody is safe, and I hope, you know, magic thunderbolt shoots it and it turns into a tropical storm. But that is not what I think is going to happen and that is not what I think you should prepare for. I think you should prepare for the worst. And so no matter what, best case scenario now is category three hurricane hits. Worst case scenario, category five hurricane hits. I did my best to warn people and that's all I can do. So, God bless everybody. Stay cool.